Hello friends, this is Marcus Fried. I just wanted to share with you a short message, a short idea for Passover. It's the festival of Pesach, which is a festival of liberation. And so today's idea is really about ways that you can find genuine liberation and genuine freedom during these days of the festival. We've got this phrase that we hear various times. In Hebrew, it's Yitziat Mitzrayim, which literally means leaving Egypt. And the whole Passover story is about remembering how the children of Israel left Egypt and got away from Pharaoh and made their way towards the Promised Land. However, many people find the festival of Pesach itself incredibly neurotic and something which really comes with a lot of frenzy, whether it's koshering the kitchen or having the family around or when are we going to begin eating. And as a result, the whole thing really becomes a burden. But I would suggest this. The phrase Yitziat Mitzrayim is a code. It's a code for leaving behind all of the things which are holding you back. And that doesn't just mean the things to do with the festival. This is really a gateway into your life, whether it's your relationships, your mindset, your physical health, your business, really everything you're doing and the whole way you're operating from. So the questions to ask are, where are you holding yourself back? Where are you effectively being a slave to your thoughts? Where are you not going for opportunities? Where in the last year have you missed potential for a new business? Where in the last year have you missed the opportunity for maybe a new relationship or chances to create a better relationship? When have you spoken negatively about yourself? When have you put yourself down? It's very interesting that the Hebrew word for Pharaoh, the king of Egypt, Paro. If you rearrange the letters, you get the Hebrew word oref, which means neck. And it's often in our neck that we restrict opportunities. It's through our throat we say, I can't do this, I can't do that, I can't do the other. But rather, on Passover, on Pesach, we're trying to think about how we can be free from all of these things. So try to think of the whole experience as a metaphor, whether you're eating the matzah, having the bitter herbs, engaging in a seder, in a Passover, Pesach celebration of some form. Just try to think of it as where are the reasons, where are the areas in my life that I'm holding back? Where can I be more liberated? Where can I be more free? And just try to take a few moments to really visualize what would your life be like if you didn't hold yourself back? What could your life be if you weren't held back by various ideas? I can't do this. I shouldn't do that. And try to visualize, really try it to picture on this particular year, what would it be like on Pesach if you were completely free? As we say every single year in my family household, we were slaves, but now we are freed. And I wish that you too can have a Passover of being completely freed in all areas of your life. If you've liked today's video, there's more available soon. The videos will be coming soon, but in the meantime, just have a think about purchasing a copy of the Kosher Sutras, The Jewish Way in Yoga and Meditation. This is the first of my books, which is going to be out in April in England, and it's be re released in May in the United States of America. I'm Marcus Fried, wishing you a very happy and kosher Passover. And whoever you are, wherever you're from, make sure that you just feel liberated. Let go of those shackles. Be free. God bless.